you just want to spray, but you can't because the sprayer leaks. In this video, I'm going to solve that problem. I'm Ollie, welcome to Source. Luckily, the problem is an easy fix. It takes a couple of minutes and you're away. You're back in business spraying and killing bugs. So let's get into it. The nozzle is probably one of the hardest things to maintain on the electrostatic sprayer. So when you take the nozzle out, you'll see behind the nozzle is a tiny green gasket. If it's dislodged in any way whatsoever, you might have a problem, and that problem is gonna be a leak. To fix the leak, take your key, insert in the sprayer, and one quarter turn to the left will remove the nozzle. Now inside the chamber, you'll see the gasket. It might be slightly dislodged if you have the leak. So take a pick or a small screwdriver and gently just prise the gasket out of the sprayer. Once you've done this, check the condition of the gasket, making sure it's got no cracks or any blockages. And do the same with your nozzle while you're there. Now to reinsert the gasket in the right position, put the nozzle into the key and the gasket onto the end of the nozzle. Then reinsert 12 o'clock one quarter turn to the left to secure it in place and then turn the key clockwise to run through the cycle of 40, 80 and 110 microns. So there we have it, a part of the sprayer that you probably never knew existed but look after that little gasket and it's going to look after your sprayer. Also it's worth noting that a bit of essential maintenance is going to keep this running sweet. Run some hot water through the tank on each different nozzle setting for about 30 seconds. Let's say every five or six hours of use. Oh, by the way, massive thanks to Chris Pitio in Florida, who's the regional rep for Victory Sprayers. And Chris came up with this really helpful tip to flush the sprayer through with the hot water and just explained how that gasket works as well. So thanks, Chris. Appreciate it. Look forward to meeting you one day at some sort of Victory Sprayer convention where they fly us all to a nice desert island. And say thanks very much for selling this machine. See you there. Anyway, back to business. So there we have it, a part of the sprayer that you probably never knew existed, but look after that little gasket and it's gonna look after your sprayer. If you have any comments or questions or any issues regarding electrostatic sprayer, just stick them in the comments below and I'll definitely get back to you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.